Yeah, he found my out my address. Eric does know I'm where gonna, I live, alright? He does know where you live. He knows my address. Yeah, I'm gonna leak it. I'm gonna leak it. Alright. He, he made a bill called Joey about me leaking I'm gonna leak Joey's address or whatever. Oh it's fake. I invite you, Joey. Now join. Alright, I'm gonna be a noob. This is my new voice. I never had a camera in Fortnite. You sound like a girl who went back like 12 years into the past. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, Joey. Oh, no. This is unacceptable. Oh, it can't be the same guy. Oh, uh, well, too bad. This is my 36. character. Actually, no. This is, this is my character. So From now has... on, I'm forever using this character. He doesn't even have the For voice of Valor ever. yet? Oh my god. Got that like a week ago. Okay, good. I can oh. switch back to my guy. Matt. Guys, what? make a better skin. What? Make a better skin. Matt and, and Joey, you have the assiest skin in the game, man. Now, Matt, just pick, do the car bribe, Matt. This is the best skin in the game, though. It's, over, it's overpowered. Because you special oh, abilities, because you're black. <laughs> no, not my skin. No, I get Fine, I'll be your skin, alright? I'm gonna be, uh, this I'm, chick. Are you being racist son, just because my character is black? You're gonna change life? him? Wow. Yeah, racist. that's racist. It's racist. I don't care. I'm Daquan's son. I don't care, it's racist. Son. I have his back <laughs> bling and his, and his, I want to call it. You his adopted yeah. son. Yeah, I'm white. Well, even though he's black, but I'm white. I'm adopted. <laughs> Let's do it. Okay, so I'll, I'll take that. Uh, Matt. Eric, Matt. Eric, Harbra, Eric, two two buns, one hot dog. This ain't this ain't gonna be enough. Come on, Matt, just switch, just 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 go Harbra, Matt. Just do it. Carbride. Yeah, go Carbride. I'll go with this skin. What tier am I? What skin? Okay, that's I guess. Uh. What's okay, next? Let's go. For next, it's me. Let me put on my, let me put on my new skin. I'm getting looted. I'm excited to get looted. I'm trying to do a nerd voice. <coughs> we're, the, we're the female oh, squad, apparently. On the looks of it. Excuse me, I am a twelve-year-old female who likes a lot of candy and has a backpack. <laughs> you sound like Tony pre um puberty. <laughs> Like prior. What? You've been grinding you more than me, Invincible? This is unacceptable. <laughs> no one forgot the bro, I your had no bills. Gonna... Yeah, but we have a higher tier than you. What do you mean? Uh, what? it's gonna you fade. Like friend? Yeah. Oh my god. Uh... I'm he's, he's my best friend, Fatal. I've known him for 12 years, and I don't even know how to pronounce his name. His name is... Gene0972. Gino. G Gino. I don't know. I'm already getting noob references. Hmm. Fatal Field. This, this is like really what I was a noob about right here. This is a good place? I'm getting house, you get stuck in my dick. Ah, too. Okay, then come here. I'll do it. <laughs> no, this boss. is my house. This is my house. Hold up. Oh, I literally God, bought this house with my own money. Here. Here, here's, a, here's a green AR in the basement if you want it. Oh, will I be alive to even see that? No. That's some guy stuck in my deck. Not a chance. Go try hard mood. I heard mood. Some guy's in my house. What the fuck? You having a nice life over there? I told him. Wow, they left. They yeah, left. For some reason. I, oh, I can't. already killed two people down. Eric, you, what happened? People, by the way. What? Did that kid have an AR? Mean? Pretty sure you did. I want that. that Wait, why do you have? Oh, never mind. I shot by shot. Someone like tried to walk into your house oh, and so, like uh, rob yeah, you. Yeah, and then and I told him to suck my dick, but he he's just no. He was like, uh, like no, not up, only on Thursdays, on honey. Uh, sure. <laughs> we'll feel right. that. Hey, um, who would win in a 1v1 in Fortnite? Me or Eric, Vincible? Who would win? Eric. Um, Eric. Eric. 
Okay, who would win, me or me or Tony? Who would win, me or Tony? Tony. Who would win, Ninja or Tony? Who oh, paused? Obviously, Ninja. What kind of method have you been? <laughs> <laughs> it's better than all of us in this party combined. Do you have an AR that you can spare? Nope. Um, it's I have one upstairs. Upstairs in the, the like the. Oh, thank you uh, for telling me where the ARs are. The very top floor. Yo, if you take it, I swear to God, I'm not gonna help you kill your your family. Okay, I won't. Take your AR, but there's a shotgun. I'm taking the shotgun because I need a shotgun. I already have a shotgun. All right, good. Because I need to rub it in my face. Wait, no, Joey. I do you know there's a new glitch here? Come here. Sure you do. I don't. Is it the no, ramp technique? Yeah, I know about that glitch. It's called me dying. No, no. So it's what's it called? You, you dance in front of us. It's like a challenge. Don't do it, Matt. Don't. What do we need to do? Come here, come here. Sneaky silences. Eric. It's it's, what? it's gonna make you go. It's gonna get you here. Go. To here, to the prison, it's pretty cool. You're dance in front of us, dance in front of us. Okay. Okay. Oh, this guy wants to do it too. <laughs> oh. I guess it's not working. Alright, you can stop now. What were you trying to do? I was watching a YouTube video, if you do it, you get banned. Oh. <laughs> I, I actually did that I before. No, that. that was a challenge. This is a challenge. No, no, no. no it's, oh it's, God, it's, if you place if you place a floor right here and you dance, you get banned. Which I'm not doing it. I'm a boss. So I'm gonna you do it. Search it out. Search I don't even care about Fortnite. I think it works anymore. Like get banned. Yeah, I'm gonna search up a YouTube video. I'm gonna search up a YouTube video. I saw. Freestyle. Minute, minute, minute. All right, guys, let's go before we get sniped or something. I wanna watch the YouTube video. Uh, I'm ready to get banned! <laughs> Look at me! Yeah, I I'm never, totally I'm not ready to get banned! banned. <laughs> action beast, action beast. This is what I think really about you, right? This is what there, I think right? about you, okay, ready? Action beast, watch me, alright? You watching me? Uh huh. This is what I think of you. Er Joey, this is what I think of you. <laughs> <laughs> this is my name, you, Joey. This is me. What? <laughs> Alright then. Uh, Ooh, you want to eat some popcorn together? This is me. I do. I do these all the this, time. This. This is what. Every game I always get this. This is Matt. This is Matt. I get that I every know. game. <laughs> uh, no. But how many no. ones do you have? You need to get carried to get this. But this is the. This is the true thing. Hold on. Let me I, got, I got two of these today. I'm really good with dynamite. Yeah, because you blow yourself up every single game. Circle. Okay, guys, let's leave. I need to farm up some maps. Hell nah. No! Abuse! But who's better, Joey or Matt? Me. I'm obviously better. Definitely. Eric, who carried um, this man to a victory royale twice? I got! Who carried him? This guy. I got a victory royale in solos all by oh, myself. Royale. That's so it's royale, Joey. Royale. Sorry, I said it right. It's just my mic being you stupid and glitch, right? Same thing. Same glitch, bro. Battle royale. There you go. It's royale. royale. Bat it's Fortnite battle royale. He's saying royale. Royale. Said Fortnite said battle royale. 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 I can't just abusing Joey while he's live streaming. I'm gonna put a part two to this. I'm gonna he's say like, no, my Invincible reputation. Trash Squad, part two. Part two. I, did you actually make that? I mean, when I get when I get you your win, well, I'm not really gonna get you your win. If we, if, 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 if like it's, if it's us and, and like a another squad, I'm killing myself. I'm not trying to get you another win. Sucks in. That doesn't deserve cover. He's drinking a chug jug and didn't even tell us that he had one. Does anyone have AR bullets? Um, no, yeah, but I need not to defend myself. Actually, no, I don't. Never mind. Eat some. Oh. Eat it, Joey. Eat the apples. The apples? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I forgot the added apples. Where's yeah. the apples at? 
Why should I tell you? You're not cool enough to learn where the apples are. There's three. Here, eat one of these first. Or you eat I like apples. our friend, Gino. I'm, I'm gonna invite him to the party. He drank a chug jug. His name's Gino972. No, he drank a chug jug. Joey, oh, did you go and do it? Right, I'm inviting our Joey, friends to the party. Joey, over there! Where's the flipping apples at? Go get it. Oh, I see him. Never mind. I see him. Never mind. Join the party. I believe they added apples to the game. Do you have any AR bullets? Samuel? I have six. I have sixty-one. I'll give you some. I'm I got over here. Never mind. Hey, you guys want to play some Battle Royale? Uh, what do you think we're doing right now? Smoking meth. Yep, sounds like it. I like doing that. Smoking radiation. That's what. Radiation is a drug. <laughs> it is. I'm not. You still don't, if you don't... Yo, Eric, look at this! Look at this mushroom! Eat it, see what I'm happens. <laughs> what if there's a feature where you can eat Please. mushrooms in this game? Oh, These are clear. Uh, hey, Joey's all the way over there. Dead. Fucking noob. I'm getting dead. rocks, alright? I'm getting brick. Resources, getting natural resources. Get on my level, Sam. Eric, the mushroom's still not dead. This is a mushroom. Now, what do you mean it's just a mushroom? Eat the mushroom and see what happens. I'm gonna die. I'm good. Yo guys, guys, come here. I found, I found the bat cave. Found the bat cave, huh? I found the Joey cave, look. Why did you call it the Joey cave? Our friend's building a base. I don't know why, but he's building a base. Yo, get out of my cave! Get out of my cave before I shoot with this shotgun. Dude, I don't care. Did you, what, did, you see, did you hear what I said, Eric? No. Wait, how does Joey have two kills? Because he literally went, he rushed. No, two people rushed oh, me and killed them off, alright? They were rushing me with pickaxes. Yo, Eric, no. Eric, his oh, cave is so small like something else. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. What? I don't listen to you. Oh, I just found an RPG! <laughs> yeah. Wait, what's that purple oh, thing no. over there? It's an um, RPG, B. RPG? Doesn't look like an RPG, is that like a... That's a hand cannon. Can. Can. I'll, I'll have two can cannons, so I can go, uh, I can double, I can go like... You're not, no. It's not oh, shooting, yeah. you know? You're, you're not a ninja, ninja, okay? Stop, you're not a ninja, okay? Hey, alright. Pretty good, alright? People miss you're... chest. There you go, chest. Oh, I found oh, a chest. Getting shot at, That's I my think. chest action, base. Oh, gosh. Stop, 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 stop! Guys, hide! Guys, hide! Oh, my, 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 my. Uh, I guess I'm double pumping. I'm double pumping now. I'm double pumping now. Oh, God! Give me my shit, bro. Give me my shit. Okay, fine. Give me my meds back. Give me my meds back. There, I gave you seven. I have to use them. Joey, okay, we're gonna see what the- You're gonna be a- You're gonna terrorist attack, okay? I'm gonna- I'm gonna- Nah, I know you're shooting on you. A terrorist oh. attack. You're gonna commit a terrorist attack on us. Oh god, they're fighting from the east. I'm no. I'm gonna go over here. Real Eric, quick. yeah, let's push. Eric, let's push. What? There's people. He, oh, there he is. What the fuck? There's people in here. What the fuck? Yeah, I know. He rocket rided here. He's dead. What the fuck? I'm BMing. Where are you? I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. I'm done. Fucking fall damage. I mean that. Oh. Well, I killed him, so. Good job. I think he only had a minigun, because I saw one thing that was legendary there, and it was a minigun. Oh, his oh, is so Eric, when I get you up, you're gonna have to start running. Well, I'm chilling, bro. I got this guy. Chilling, I'm baby. Time to play ninja. Yeah, Joe, you better catch it, bro. It's every day, bro.
Rain sickness. Watch your way. Oh my god, they're shooting, oh, crap, they're I'm shooting from the for west. Reason. We're, oh god, we're getting shot from every direction. Is you guy right here, Joey? Help. Got this. I got him. There you go. Juicy. Grab oh, there's another guy. Kill him. Can I build? Do I even build, bro? Alright, someone move at me, please. I got him. Get him. Oh, build God, walls! Build die. walls! I'm not done on Trump, okay? You have to build walls in oh this game God. to survive! Shut Dude. up, Joey! No one cares! Oh my gosh. Oh God, this is not good. Bag it. Shut up, Joey! You're one to talk, okay? Damn. DMing. You get- you deserve that, man. You coming, Eric? Oh crap, there's another guy coming in. Building walls. Oh my god, it's a toxic trooper. Toxic trooper. Hey. Open up a little thing for me, so I can call and you can me. No, screw you! Why? You need me. This is ghetto, Matt. I'm keeping myself alive! Joey, your ass. Get Gino, nobody cares about Joey. Can I edit? You're reviving, we're reviving, you're reviving him. And you're not reviving One me. One second, he's got lower health than you, calm down. <laughs> oh, there's some guy from RPGs getting me. Guy oh, from RPGs just survived. He was gonna die. I'm dead. Ugh. Oh. <laughs> I blame this on Joey. You blame this on me. I had no I weapon. Yeah, I had sure. a desert eagle. Well, that's what you probably should have used. You're the one who wanted to pick it up. Should have used it right. Turn it off the fill, Eric. Wait. Matt. What? Soccer ball. Yeah. What about it? <clears throat> rain. It's raining outside. Oh, it's raining? Hey, Rain, uh, what do you do with a soccer ball? You kill yourself! Then make the party over, don't we? Yeah. Why don't you like him anymore? I don't know, he's annoying. I don't like him anymore, it's just like, it's not the time. Alright, I better fuck. Is it a pressing high of the whole entire lollipop set, or whatever it's called? Maybe. I'm not sure. <laughs> I declined to fuck you guys, I know. He like me. Oh, that's when you get when you use meth. I've never seen Eric on Discord before. I mean, he's never on there. He was smoking a bunch of meth the other day. He was used and abused. Where the crap are we really going? Just do that. Uh, Fine. Where do you want to go? Fine. I guess we're going over here. You can go here. Sure, I'll definitely go over there. We're not Come following on. KK Clutch. We're going over here. That's where we're going. You're an idiot. Okay, if you die, I'm not coming to revive you. Okay then. If we meet um, what happens if you die? Eric will save me. We're going to fatal again. Ugh. KK already left. I hope you die. Hey, that kid that was with me was is not here for me now for some reason. No. Oh, I didn't know there was a meteor here. Uh, meteors across the map? Dumb. Dumb dumb. Oh, really now? You're dumb! You take a look at Fatal You're Field. dumb dumb! You're the dumb one. 
You're dumb. You're dumb. You're dumb. Yeah, I'm dumb. Really. Number one, who's the person hey, who can't speak correctly? I'm and to, he doesn't even know how to I'm play Fortnite. I'm trying to act like Jackie good. Chew, but I can't. Yeah, damn. Can't nail it down. You're not Jackie Chew. Don't even try to be Jackie Chew. I be Jeffy. Oh, oh, oh. You cannot be Jeffy. You sound like a really, really messed up Jeffy. Mm, 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 mm. Eric, are you getting shot at? Mm, mm, mm. Ah! Uh, yep, that would explain it. It's crazy, it's crazy, it's crazy. Come, 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 Matt, 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 now, no, 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 come on, no, no, come on, no, come on, I gotta break out of the house. Matt, Matt, shut up! I'm running. You're running. <laughs> no, he's coming for me! I got you, fam. Oh, look at his ninja boy. He revives his teammate, by the way. Yeah, he does, he does the oh, top up? box. Oh, behind you, behind you! You're dead! Hey, Joey! Wow. We're not, no, we're not playing with Joey anymore. Get out of here, Joey. Why? All right. I thought we were going over there. It was my fault. Oh my god. All right, then. I had an LMG. Beware. Teachers are armed to the teeth with ways to ensure you are taking tests honestly. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the top five most insane anti-cheating methods in school. ...videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we'll be looking at strategies used by teachers to stop students from cheating. And in that regard, there are no restrictions. We'll be looking at everything from simple tests to high count and throughout the world. Awesome. 
results in order to attend university. But one has to wonder if those are really necessary. Number three, there's in the classroom. After noticing an increase in cheating in Indian colleges, I decided soldiers are hired to form a squad that supervises students during nations. The goal of the regarding cheating out of 40,000 students for the certification and 6 out of 30,000 people. Obviously makes you think twice. No internet allowed during Andy, what happened? Oh, it has no internet. During examination periods in Iraq, the government decided to cut down on So, alright, today we're gonna try to play at least as many matches as possible so we can get the free thing. And uh, yeah, free emo. Plus, the spray paint stuff as well. On the walls and crap. Yeah, I wanna get that. You need to build a little faster next time.
Oh, why did he can't attack me from the side? Oh, I thought he was attacking me from the top. Dang it! Ah, that's annoying. Extremely annoying. <clears throat> The match is gonna be extremely annoying. Where did my phone go? Crap! I lost my phone. Uh, I'm gonna go to Fatal. I'm gonna go to him, over there and take him on. Oh, I'm feeling vibrations. Guys, I've been feeling vibrations. I think there's a new code coming in. Damn, build sometimes, it's annoying.
That guy was lucky. He went around me. I should have built, um, around me before I went in. That's what I do next time. Oh, good players. Good player. I think so. I, did. I think I joined the wrong mode too. Oh, yay. Yeah. I mean, the people think you play play. Yeah. Oh my god, I just lost my touch today for some reason. You need to be more aggressive. I can't be more. That was a area person. This is ULs. I need to go to Tilted Towers more and get um, better. We're f I can't hang out. I can't hang out. Um, where all the places, all the um, can't hang out in the places where players don't go much. I need to go to like Whiskey Wells, Tilted Towers, um, Pleasant Park, Retail Row, Silty Springs, like those pla places. Get better because that's how I think I'm gonna get better at this game. That way. I need to grab a gun and destroy people. Right there. I'm getting a gun. Right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. I'm gonna... Nice one, dude. You got me. <laughs> okay. Okay. That was in places where... Um... Where people will be, because I, I need to get better at building and stuff, and getting in gunfights and stuff. I can't hang out in the places like that anymore. <laughs> Again. 
Oh crap, I, I missed my spot. No, I'm going tilted. We have John Wick. We have John. We have John Wick skins here. Okay. Let's do this. The John Wick. Any weapon he has will be powerful. This on real quick, hopefully, it won't die. Two kills. This is pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. And I should have just built to you instead of do just shooting it. That would have been in better mode. That may be been better for me. Let's do this. able to get so good at Fortnite so incredibly quickly and play at such a high level. Well today in this video I'm going to be
We're gonna use a shotgun. Into this list, okay? So we are gonna kick this off with one of the biggest tips, but not the biggest tip, on how these YouTubers and pro players are able to be so good at Fortnite, all right? So like I said, let's get right into it okay coming in at the number three spot we actually have a way that makes players oh, I or enemy players on the map easier to see pop out more and be way more visible and you'll be able to see them a little but they won't necessarily be able to see them. that is actually in the I got it! Why? How? I got that trap that prevented him to come down. I pressed X before him, I'm pretty sure I got it. Whatever, I got this, guys. All right. Oh, did he get him? Oh, I must be the guy who took my weapon, I'm pretty sure, maybe. Did you see that, guys? Build crap.
nice one, dude. That was a good game. Good game, but no one would have... No one would not leave me alone, so I eventually died. I would heal up, but I didn't much have time, and I tried to flee from the area because I wanted to engage with the guy. Thousand V bucks four times. All right, you get four entries at winning fifty thousand V bucks. All right, so your chances of winning are pretty, pretty up there. So make sure you smash the like button and enter that big, big giveaway. Thank you for all the support on the channel recently. Now this next tip I'm going to be giving you guys is in the community something that used to be huge in other video games but for some reason in fortnite people don't really take advantage of except for the youtubers who have been playing video games and making videos on the games for years and years and years are the only people that really know about this controller hack to actually make your sniping aim your assault rifle aim or even just your shotgun aim at close quarters way way better and the tip is simple okay and oh, yeah, a little bit of science towers. behind it but i'm gonna explain it to you guys so the tip is actually using smaller thumbsticks okay that's right ladies and gentlemen oh, thumbsticks thumb on the controller you are using right now are holding you back from your maximum potential of a fortnite player if your thumbsticks were even twice the size that they were now you would be able to make much 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 more minor adjustments to your aim and have way more control over your actual character since you have that added range of motion. That We're going to this house over here. We're going to the alien house. That's where Aiken calls. Oh crap. Change of plans. We're going over here because I don't. Because he. He probably knows the. Uh, engage some people. That was sweet, guys. Did you see that? Slow pro player over here, guys. Pro player. Pro player. Pro player. Nice one, dude. Got too nervous, and I didn't have time to shoot there. Uh, he was just snuck up on me. Should have built. If I had hit on um, meds or even shields, I would have probably survived, but I did not. So a lot of the top professional players now. This is a mainly a console-related thing because thumbsticks aren't a thing if you play on the PC, but if you play on console, getting extended thumbsticks is the best way to improve your aim.
which can make you build way, way faster. Personally, I use Griptex. They are the cheapest ones on the market, but they are the highest quality ones on the market at the exact same time. I have used every single type of controller, thumbstick, add-on, and all guys. Uh, in the community, every single brand, and Griptech is by far the best. Just $15.99, you get four pairs, two different tall pairs, and two different short pairs. In case you're not looking to improve your accuracy, you just want added grip to your controller thumbstick. You can get that as well, all for $15.99. So if you're really looking to improve your I may have to get you this grip tech stuff make me better. The way faster is to actually be able to play on the same level as a lot of these professional players or even just higher skilled players that you may be running into online, then the Griptech Precision Apex can really help even that playing field uh, and help elevate your game to the absolute next level. Now the next tip that I have for you guys is also another controller hack. This one unfortunately is a little bit more pricey than the uh, the Griptech, which are only 15 Oh, Oh, I can't. Modded controller. I just get modded controller. I can't spend money on stuff I get better at Fortnite. I'm not spending money to get better on Fortnite. Now they need to learn new tricks and stuff to get better. Run now, guys. The guy has the famos. It's pretty good, I guess. <sighs> we have a different distance to travel, but whatever. Okay. Let's do What? You are the one that you invited me. Building over there. I want that. I want to get part of that. Vince will invite me for no reason. I don't have no shotguns. So if we get into close battle, the mines. Gonna have to do, but whatever. Just 
on what guys be careful. How loot does he have? Oh crap, you got me. Wow, good job, dude. You killed me. to $300 depending on how much you actually want to put into uh, making the absolute best controllers. But what absolutely every single one of the top Fortnite console players use is not a normal PS4. Let's go to Greasy again. Put on our try hard pants and vex the haters. Oh, I can't play music on um on the stream. Sorry guys, can't play music. Nice one, dude. You got me. The John Wick, of course, it's a flipping John. I sir, people who have a John Wick skin, I'm like 99% chance I'm gonna die because because. If you have a John Wick skin, that means you're a good player. Automatically, alright? That's why I see people with John Wick skins. If you have a John Wick skin, that means I'm gonna be nervous and I'm gonna kill you because... And chances are you're gonna kill me because... Whatever. Plus, I got a shotgun and I didn't have a shotgun and killed me and whatever. But, yeah. <coughs> Risky bells, it looks like.
that gun over there. That's, that's a oh crap. Yeah, that's a scar. I think there was one dude here. I got my shield. guys that was pretty good i think i'm more to becoming a better player at fortnite a better fortnite player about set. Let me get this one last chance and I think we'll be set and I don't need anything else. Alright, I'm set. Let's move. I have a scar and a shotgun. Uh, way up there. I'm not gonna try to fight him. I'm not here.
I can find an apple, I think I'm gonna be okay. Not sure how you get apples. There's a special way you need to do it. An apple. I right, we go back to full health. Do this, but that's just a waste. Big waste. I'm not gonna go over here because. I've got enough loot, unless you get a rocket launcher, or a grenade launcher, or even a sniper rifle, or a better shotgun. Or a legendary scar would be cool too, but... For now, I have pretty good loot, and I'm ready. I have a scar, and I'm ready to tear crap up. My scar. Find two people left. Let's do this, guys. Guy way over there, but I want just want to get to my area. Going. Engage that guy, but I don't want you. Way over there. I don't want to fight him. I don't want to fight that guy. I keep moving and jumping. Donald. Fire, of course. Tilt the towers. Should be careful. I got him. just to get some cover. Keep an eye out for a noob around here. Hey, there's people coming in from there.
good though. That was good. Be right back, guys. Alright guys, let's do this. Play. Mm -hmm. I get looted next. Can't wait to leave that around the map. It looted. The looted. Leave the looted sign. And stuff. Yeah, it's gonna be epic. Imagine they added like a ninja spray paint. That'd be awesome. Alright, uh, Pleasant Park. We're going to Pleasant Park, guys. Pleasant Park. I know go to Til I know I can go to Tilted, but I don't want to go to Tilted because reasons. Closer. And Tilted I usually die at really, really easily. So uh, that's why I'm not going to Tilted today. But, guys, we will go to one of these houses in Greasy. I'm not sure what house. That blue house over there is. Not the one on the right, but the one with the gray roof. One of the gray roof. Yeah, that's, we're going for that. No one. No one else is going for the gray roof. I'm probably going to. I was wrong. There are people going in to it. Good job, dude! I have his head in my sight. If I pulled the trigger, he would have been dead. But, he had a shotgun and he pulled the, sh the trigger way easily um, before me. And he killed me off. So, yeah. You? What do we 
going through the top five most embarrassing graduation fails. I figured I'd do this list because it's about that time of the year where people start graduating from high school, college, and every year people occasionally kind of embarrass themselves really badly. We're going to enjoy that. But before we get this video, if you've ever been to a graduation ceremony, whether you were the person who graduated or not, make sure you leave a like on this video. If you've never been to one, leave a like anyways. And if you haven't already, uh, comment down below and tell me the craziest graduation fail that you've ever seen in your life. Maybe it was you, maybe it was one of your friends and family members. I don't know your life is like. Uh, and also make sure to subscribe to the channel because it'll really help out. But let's get into this top five, which is actually a top eight. And then a very smart little girl who's wearing some high heels on the football field during a graduation ceremony. And that didn't go too well for her because she could not keep her balance whatsoever uh, because of the shoes she was wearing. It ended up kind of walking like a, a zombie or a baby deer trying to learn how to walk. I don't know. Uh, and ended up going for a, a, a bit of a fall. <laughs> Oh, I should I should have switched to my gun and shot him because he had a tactical. I should assume that not all shotguns are pumps. For seven, I gotta be straightforward in this one. This one looks painful. It's probably one of the more painful looking ones. This dude on this stage, uh, all their parents and probably thousand plus people, uh, only to go and just have this happen to him when he was leaving the stage after he got his diploma. And like I said, this just looks like it hurt like shit. I really hope some high school kids that are about ready to graduate are watching this video. And uh, this shit is just making them super nervous. That would that would just warm my heart inside. Troy, Jeffrey. Number oh. six, you get a girl who's oh. walking down the sidelines of this football field in the line of her classmates wearing some high heels, and she ended up falling time after time again. Going for the alien house. Hold up. Oh, and uh, retail. Oh, no, 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 it's not it's salty, not. Ooh. Boy, this is gonna be tough.
Yep, I'm dead. No weapons, I have no guns, no guns, no guns, no guns. I can't find any guns, crap! I have to be extremely careful and not die. Wow! Uh, if I had guns, I would have done okay. Maybe, probably. No. Uh, just as you'd expect, you really just shouldn't wear high heels to your graduation ceremony. I mean, I'm probably in the minority on this one. I actually, uh, I guarantee I am, but I can't stand high heels. I think they look stupid, and they're just impractical. Like, just wear some sneakers or some sandals or some shit like that, and walk faster. <laughs> Nice one, kid, but nice. That was a nice job, but nice.
Wow. Better play than I thought it was. Was crap. That is the only weapon that you have. Night. Okay, pulled some pretty good crap right there with a grenade launcher. I'm not sure why he used the grenade launcher, but okay. She tried. Moving on through three, this one's not quite as much of an embarrassing fail or something like that, because this girl did this on purpose, but. Uh, she faced a lot of backlash after she did it because a lot of people thought it was really weird or pissed some people off. But what she did was after she got her diploma, uh, she literally just walked out of the graduation ceremony instead of going and sitting back down for the rest of the ceremony, which uh, I'll be honest, I was tempted to do the same thing because graduation ceremonies, if you've ever gone through one of those, they are the most boring, like, time bullshit things that you've ever fucking be a part of. But well, watch this graduate. <laughs> Michelle Gray proudly takes her diploma and walks off the stage, just like all the other students. She poses for the official photo. Then she heads up the aisle. So far, so good. But wait. He's not stopping. She walks straight out the door. Where's she going? No turning back for this graduate. It's see you later. With a 19-year-old posted the video epic exit on social media, reaction has, well, kind of mixed. Disrespectful and tacky, wrote one mom. But young people seem to have another opinion. It's amazing. I'm a student who really pissed people off or did something super embarrassing. It was. Went on this rant, and she had, I guess, kind of a, an okay reason to go on this rant at the start. But then it got really bad towards the end where she went full blown racist. Uh, against some people in the audience. Y'all owe this young man an apology, especially that goober that was coming through with his little thing. In DeKalb County, Georgia, pomp and circumstance overshadowed by an angry principal. You, you little coward, come on back up here. The principal, Nancy Gorduke, accidentally skipped the valedictorian speech, now unsuccessfully trying to regain the audience's attention. You people are being yeah. so rude. Gorduke visibly upset as she watches people leave. Did you hear that? The principal lashing out in what many described as a racist outburst. Listen again. The crowd now out. And finally, number one, sorry, this video off with one that happened actually before graduation. Uh, but these kids, they were trying to pull off a senior prank. It was like eight kids. Uh, and they all had this pact not to do anything like super bad when they went into the school and started going crazy with it. They did some, uh, you know, crazy stuff. But the real crazy thing was when one of them literally shit in the sink in one of the bathrooms. And that's what ended up getting them in like big banned from going to their own graduation because they shit in this sink and i don't know i just thought it's kind of memorable that you know maybe uh, one day you look back and remember that you couldn't go to your own graduation because you literally shit in the sink for eight seniors the home of the grizzlies has become the school of hard knocks we went to the school around two in the morning went in through a window and 
TP'd it. We put string to each other's lockers, and then we put paint on windows. Oh, sticky notes. That doesn't do anything. Before entering the school, the eight seniors said they made a pact not to damage school property. It wasn't until they exited the building that they learned that not all of them had kept their bargain. One kid had a bad decision of defecating in the sink. And for many in the school, the prank had crossed the line. Administrators decided the students could not attend this morning's senior breakfast, tonight's senior awards dinner, nor walk across the stage to... If you enjoyed, if you did, make sure you like on this video. If we can bring 10,000 likes, that'd be insanely. These clips. Is I would have died if I did not, um, if I did not put out those shields on. Nice one, dude. Using your LMG to kill me. Should use that for bases. This is your fail. Which one of these graduation fails was the funniest, most embarrassing? And let me know if uh, you've ever gone to a graduation, whether you are the person graduating or it was one of your friends. Jeffy's bath time is the first time Jeffy's ever had a bath because that means he smells really bad. For 12 years, he never had a bath. And he also poops his pants 24-7. So, and, and no one wipes it because the diaper's on the outside of his pants and his pants are sewn to his body. Yeah, so anyway, you're probably thinking, Logan, uh, what are you doing? Why are you using a blue screen instead of a green screen? Well, we want to try out the blue screen to see how it looks. And I, so far, I like it. I think it looks really cool, but very smooth, very smooth in the background. Yeah, but we'll see how the editing software likes it. Dude. Like, I, I think I've been using green screen all my life. Let's use blue screen. So, yeah, we're, we're gonna we're gonna try out all the colors. We're not racist here on the show. We, we all type of colors: blue, green. We, we might even do a red screen. I'm not even sure. But Jeffy's bad time. Time afterwards, we have to talk for at least four minutes and 38 seconds in order for it to be a tip. Yeah, guys, I, real quick, you don't really make money off YouTube unless a video hits 10 minutes. So, anyway, let's get the video started. I'll be telling you some behind the scenes stuff, so watch the video here because this is where you need to watch it. And after the video, I have an important announcement to explain what's been going on with my videos and the channel. So, let's get into it in 3, 2, 1, clickety clack. We are back. Typical Jeffy, starting it off smacking. Smack it, are you ready? Uh, they're ready. 
Good job, dude. Good job, dude. Good job, dude. Too many tries. We had to throw all the clothes in order. Every single time. And then Jeff just walked by, stunt double. Jeff's pants can't come off. Yeah, the real Jeffy's pants are sewed to him. So if he ever wants to be naked, it has to be a stunt double. That's why you didn't see a face. Yeah, that's why you didn't see a face. And then this is Jeffy's pants. Jeffy's pants are sewed to How you get sick in Fortnite, guys?
Jeff, you want to take a shower instead? Yeah, Daddy. I just need one day. Yeah, I was getting so wet. Yeah, you need a shower. Yeah, you need a shower. I'm not sure what the crap happened there, but Whoa, I need to get my grip on again. I'm I've been amazing on this new strategy, but not now. I just thought I, I like now I like showers more, but back then. And then you take a, a cup of the water. If I had to if you had to bathy Jeffy. What you... uh, yeah, what would you But the video I, I don't know what happened that night. It just nothing. When I think of an idea, usually it's really good. Like I'm thinking, okay, it's gonna be great. But when you actually start filming it, the scenes don't go as long as you think they are. Like you think, okay, this is gonna be a long scene, but actually the scene was only. Like, that I was going to make was. Um, if you're wondering why, I used to upload every single day on this account, and I still want to. I can't publish a video and monetize, so what it happened is... And I have to request a review. I have to wait for them to confirm that it's not zero for okay. And what they've been doing recently is, I'll upload our hours will go by, and then they'll end. And... And re resubmit it until it gets monetized. So I've been uploading every day. It's just so. Uh, the next SML. There should be a new SML. Oh, again with the flipping LMGs! Why? 
Oh, you already named Announce that, and I also wanted to milk the video to be 10 minutes. <laughs> so I had to explain. But no, I, I, you know, do, I need to understand what we are still trying. We're still filming. Uh, we're still working on trying to get you guys new SML movies. I know we're not uploading as much as we should be, but it's not our fault. And I don't want to move to Super Bowser Logan yet because eventually that account will get attacked too, and then I'll have no accounts to run to. So anyway, go subscribe to Super Bowser Logan because we're going to start doing some gaming videos, some Fortnite videos, some just broken guy play videos. We're going to be doing a lot of gaming videos with Super Bowser Logan. Lance got ads on his account. Woo! Ads! So go subscribe to Lance's account. Uh, what do you do on that one? Uh, everything. Fan mail, fan mail, vlogging, video game. My Fortnite video is really funny. To me. Anything with the Jeffy T Ball team, that's a. Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Prestige. Welcome back to Call of Duty Black Ops 4. I got some more gameplay here for you. This is courtesy, once again, of Nico Val. You can find his YouTube channel linked down below in the description. I thought since not many other content creators were discussing it, we would talk about specialists, the ones that we were able to use in the multiplayer preview that we got at the reveal event, and of course, the ones that are coming in the future. I'm extremely comfortable in saying 100% that there are going to be at least 10 specialists at the launch of Black Ops 4. Who knows? Maybe there's going to be more than 10. We'll just have to wait and see. But I'm going to talk about all the specials that I know of. And of course, you know, once again, huge Activision for flying me down and providing hotel and travel accommodations. Allowing me to go. The thing that we all need to know right off the bat multiplayer is no longer 6 feet. 100% fine. It works great in modes like Deathmatch, Domination, Hardpoint, and the new mode Control, which we'll talk about in a separate video. Specialists have also changed a little bit in Black Ops 4. No longer are you selecting your specialist in the pregame lobby. You do that at the beginning of the game when it starts. You're going to see your list of specialist characters on the right side of the screen, and that's your opportunity to choose what specialist you want to play as. There's still a choice here, so you can be any specialist you want. The downside is, though, you can only have one type of that specialist on the field, so you're not allowed to have two ruins on the field at the same time on your team. You're not allowed to have three batteries or five seraphs. You can't do that. Everyone needs to play as a different specialist. And if you'll be locked off, it'll look like this. And I'm actually kind of nervous how this is going to act as people who are solo players. The next change is our special weapons and special abilities. You guys remember back with Call of Duty Black Ops 3, we were able to choose either an ability or, of course, a weapon. So, for example, Seraph had Combat Focus or her Annihilate. Ruin had the ability to use gravity spikes or, of course, allowed her to run a little bit faster. But in Black Ops 4, you no longer have a selection. Wow, I got your flipping new! Because he got attacked in the behind! You have to fumble around with that anymore. The only choice that you have for your specialist is whether or not you want to take a special issue piece of equipment with them. If you go into the creative class section of Black Ops 4, you'll be able to choose things like trophy systems, molotovs, frag grenades, combat axes, and I think a concussion grenade is in there. But all the way at the end, you'll have something called special issue. The special issue is a specific piece of equipment dedicated to whatever specialist you take. These can be things from cluster grenades, sensor darts, and we'll talk about the rest once we actually start going in depth with the specialists, but just remember that choosing this special issue equipment completely nulls and voids anything else you're using, like a trophy system, a Molotov, a frag grenade. You have the choice you in battle or whether or not you want a molotov or frag grenade that's completely up to you so there's there's a balancing act here in the creative class but anywho let's move on and talk about the eight specialist characters we were able to play as in this free alpha that was provided at the event for 
first off, I want to talk about the characters that we've already had before, starting with Sarah. Sarah is bringing back her Annihilator from Black Ops 3, and it is still just as powerful as ever, providing one-shot kills as long as you land on target. Of course, she has a special issue equipment called the TAC Deploy, and this allows you to place a tactical deployment system anywhere on the map, and allows your team to spawn on that tactical actually pretty damn cool and it can disrupt the combat loop quite efficiently if you on something like the B objective on domination. Of course this can be destroyed fairly quickly and of course if you're spawning on it the enemy can still kick your ass if it's right in the open. The next specialist we're going to talk about today is Ruin. Ruin of course has his gravity spikes in Black Ops 3 but in this game he has something called the Grab Slam which is basically the same. It's a kinetic device that delivers a fast radius around the Grapple Gun. I had some gameplay of this from the other day. I'll put some gameplay up on the screen so you can take a look at it. The Grapple Gun is pretty good. It has a short radius in which you can actually hit things, but it allows you to pull yourself up out of the water Cyber or crap. you run across a different path that you wouldn't normally be able to make with the jump. The Grapple Gun is effective in that aspect. It allows you to get point A to point B faster as well, so if you need to help capture an objective, you can definitely Specialist making a return is, of course, Battery. She brings her War Machine back, and it's exactly the same as Black Ops 3. It's a high-explosive grenade launcher. It looks a little bit different in this game, which is totally appreciated. And then, of course, her special issue equipment is a cluster. Got a glimpse of in the... That was a brilliant kill with the sniper rifle there. I'm not gonna lie, that was a pretty good move. Let's pick that up if I need to do that. That was a, that was an awesome sniper kill I got there. You know he was attacking a new, but I don't know where he was. Um, plus that guy was more vulnerable and he wasn't moving, so I sniped him.
by tilt the towers. Hopefully, we won't die. I'm going to um, wait here in case someone from uh, Shifty or Tilted comes through, and I can snipe them. Be good tactic. And then later I can... Actually, maybe you should do it. Over here, more because I'm gonna be running from the fun later. Shifty is somewhere around here, so I should be careful. Mine. She's mine. She's mine. I got her. She was she, I'm a bad it. I'm a bad shot. I should be careful in case she shoots me or something. So oh, she's way over there. She's past that tree. So I'm gonna kill this noob. See if she has any building materials or what. He knows that um, I'm chasing her, I think. I'm pretty sure that just went through her. I'm pretty sure. I... Don't take my kill, dude. Stuff I don't want. I'm dead. Okay, I think I played enough games. I didn't win it. We... I'm gonna get a friend over and have him kill... Get killed. Trailer. Wait, no, I'm gonna search more boxes. I need to search more ammo boxes. Cause even more damage and or death.
Now, finally, for special okay, well, characters making the return, again. we have Firebreak. The Purifier is back again for his specialist weapon. And you know what? I really do like it, but it feels a lot different. Black Ops 3 was an instant death. If you touch somebody with even a small inkling of fire, they're instantly more health, you do need to hold the purifier on a target a little bit longer. The special issue equipment for Firebreak is the reactor core. You basically place this anywhere and it creates an area of denial. It will light people on fire and whatever damage is done to them while they're in your area of denial, they will not be able to regenerate their health at that point. So let's say they have 150 and they get knocked down for the tower, health, guys. They cannot heal up past 50 until they die and reset or they get healed by crash, which we're going to talk about right now. Crash is our new specialist in this game, and he is going to be our support and our medic. He's going to be bringing in something called Attack 5 that will heal, boost max health, and remove wounds of the user and up to four targeted allies. This is really, really nice if you use this on all four of your teammates. Oh, and it does go pretty quick, so don't think you're going to be out there like a juggernaut, but as a specialist ability, it is really nice. You're not going to see it often. Uh, but when you do, it works pretty well. The other cool thing is this works through walls. So if you have a teammate that's like all the way across the map through like a dozen walls, you can still target them, shoot them, and of course they'll get the boost, even if you're all the way across the map. So this is a character that I truly, truly enjoy using. Uh, the assault pack is his special issue equipment. You can throw these down. I'm sure you've seen gameplay Whoa, if you okay. pick up the assault pack. It can kill with the magazine is what the events are calling it. Get extra support towards your street. And use that gun during that time you have the golden ammo, you will, of course, get extra score. We spoke about it in yesterday's video where we talked about the equipment, but if you pair up this assault pack with the ComSec device, you're going to be earning score streaks extremely quickly. The next specialist is Ajax. His special weapon is the ballistic shield, and it has a built in shield. This is actually pretty dang cool because you don't need to uncover yourself from that ballistic shield. You can actually push the gun through the shield in front of you. This thing isn't incredibly overpowered. I got to use it a couple of times. I got some gameplay going on the screen right now. But uh, either way, I like this a lot. You can still get shot in the back, just like if you were using a riot shield or anything like that. But this is really and it lasts pretty much the entirety of your life. Uh, but once the bullets are done, you can't really use it. Ajax has a special issue equipment called Nine Bane. It's attack grenades that flash the stun flashes that are bound to happen, and this is extremely devastating, especially if they're not using the perk one resistance. Resist. Our next new specialist is called Torque, and he is absolutely one of my because of the barricade. When your specialist meter is ready, you can call on this barricade to deploy reinforced cover, and if you thought that sounded good, well, it has a built-in guardian, so you can actually block off specific paths with this if you use it effectively. Now, but one of the big things about this is you can actually take it down yourself or the enemies can use it. So it's not too extremely overpowered. And the barricade is big enough to protect yourself alongside two other teammates that are standing directly behind it. For a slew of different reasons, but uh, I think one of the biggest reasons is, well, just being able to have time to heal. Throwing that barricade down and, of course, using a syringe, that is going to be a make or break game changer. And uh, finally, we have the razor wire, which is, of course, towards special issue equipment. I'm sure you've seen this in the trailer. The razor wire gets thrown down, and it will damage and slow enemies that attempt to cross it. You can shoot it to destroy it. It does have a pretty decent amount of health before it's just completely destroyed. I've noticed he's really good for modes like control, where you have to actively block off paths. So set down that barricade, put down some razor wire, and actively cook and slice your meal at the same time. I'm not a cannibal, I promise. Now, our final new specialist that we're able to get hands-on with is Recon. Recon, of course, boasts the Vision Pulse ability. It's a little different, though, from Black Ops 3. Not only does it show enemies to you, but... Whoa, what? Everybody... Oh, he must have chilled. Crap. I shot him. I shot him in the body. And he survived that. It's great for control I had to kill. I had to damage him for sure. To know where the enemies 
I am straight to the head and killed him. Special issue equipment oh, for recon is a sensor dart. It is a sensor equipment that reveals enemies in its proximity on the mini map. Now you're probably sitting there wondering, well, wait, I thought you said there was going to be at least ten people. And yeah, if we take a look at the trailer, you're going to notice a lot of different specialists coming together and kind of fighting alongside of each other. In fact, I think the one specialist I noticed right away was this one with this dog. What is this dog? Who is this specialist? And I'm comfortable saying that this specialist is a younger version of Nomad. At the event itself, there were cases scattered all around okay. the actual arena, not in the game. I mean, these cases showed off some real-life equipment. Wings of Victor. Of Let's try to unlock that thing. before I end the stream. If we take a look at Nomad's case and compare it to this particular player model in the game, I mean, the colors are going to match up. It almost looks like a gilly lake. I don't really think it's going to be a good game. invite this kid who's from my school. Nomad knew the way of the model to what's happening in the game and take a look at the special bar you notice there's a full head right there where you would call in a specialist uh, ability or weapon so at this point i firmly believe that you are all in a pool with your specialist weapon and it's gonna follow you around kind of like quickly and then eventually just go after people fucking so we do know that profit will be in this game profit from black ops 3 Here's the picture of the case at the event, and of course we know that this is taking place in the past, so this is before Prophet was fully cybernetic. We don't have a full cyborg anymore, he's just a regular human. Now, as I'm scrubbing through the trailer, I didn't find anything with Prophet in there. There's no gameplay of Prophet, there, he's not on the battlefield at all, I don't really know what to think. But if we take an extremely close look at the power in numbers cinematic that was released by Trader Card Specialist, we're going to notice a specialist here that isn't actually mentioned in game or actually mentioned at all in the trailer. We don't see this person in the trailer. This could quite potentially be Prophet in the past. Of course, we know that he is not cybernetic here. We know that he's using a, a sniper rifle of some sort. And it is possible that this could be his rifle of choice back in the past. But in the future, when everything gets an upgrade, that's when he gets the Tempest. So that's what I'm thinking right here. Um, the one thing that kind of gives it away is the shoulder pad. That is normally the same type of gear that Prophet would use in Black Ops 3. And if you take a look at his wrist, he's got a lot of mechanical stuff going on. The clothing in the case at the event even looks similar to what we're looking at right here. And if we read the description on the case, it says, Representing the cutting edge of combat technology to disrupt opponents' tactics and prevent them from closing in. This is definitely possible... Uh, and when you think of sniper rifle, you think of far distance engagements and yeah, disruptions. So I'm going to say that this is probably profit. Guys, let us know what you think down below in the comments section.
Alright guys, I'm about ready. We're just gonna go all random and see what happens. Alright, let's do this. And I'm just, I'm just gonna end the stream here, guys. Um, yeah. See you guys.